Bolaranga against Viking Norwegian Elite Series match this Sunday, 24th of July, 5 p.m. kickoff time in the UK. And a Bolaranga side who have won their last two fixtures against Christiansen 3 0 and Sarpsborg 1 0. Consecutive clean sheets for the first time in ages for Volarenga. Dog LF Fagermo was close to um, losing his job. I mean, several uh, quarters would have had him fired, to be honest. I think it was it was a good time for him to move on. But to be fair to Fagermo, he showed his credentials, certainly last week, with a great tactical game plan away at Sarpsborg. Got them that 1-0 win, which was a, was a deserved success, in my personal opinion. It might just be the turning um, point for Volarenga. They're a bit short-handed in terms of defence, uh, potentially for this game. Zuta and Asberg are doubtful, might play though. Um, and, you know, they need to reinforce the transfer market a bit. But there's a much better feeling around them. I like their organisation uh, here and I like them to win this game. I think I'm, I'm going to take them on a minus a quarter handicap. Uh, but I really think it's a good favourable situation. And I'll tell you why, because Viking, despite winning the last two, both of them wins have been uh, in the last minute. And you could say, I'm not saying they're undeserved, but... There were 50-50 contests which could have gone either way. On another day, they might have even lost or drawn. Uh, but I don't like uh, about Viking this week. They played three days ago in the Europa Conference League qualifier in, against Sparta Prague. They somehow ground out a 0-0 draw. I don't know how because Sparta Prague had about 30 shots in that game. Um, and, you know, they put a hell of a lot of effort in. A you know, great result. And I'm sure they'll have an eye on the second leg uh, as well. That would probably be the priority. But... You know, they're not used to travelling away that far. They're not used to being under pressure so much like that. What are they going to have left in the tank for this game? I think Volarenga can definitely take advantage. There's a chance of a draw. I think this will be quite a low-scoring match. I think it will be, I'm not saying a poor quality game. I think it will not be like end-to-end high-tempo sort of thing. So I think there's a good chance Volarenga might just win to nil again. Like 1-0, nil, 2-0 nil, I'm thinking. Of course, Viking, Veton Barish has now signed for Hammerby. And uh, Zlatko Tripic is doubtful after coming off injured in that uh, qualifying match in Prague. So I'm going to go Volarenga minus a quarter handicap at 1.88. I think it's a good little price. It covers a bit uh, draw, but I think they win.